So I want to make a posh tosh type tube. This is a metal slipstream style tube. I want to put a butt on it. So I'm going to use this uh, uni floss. Neon orange. You can use glow bright if you want. So I'm going to put that on. And we'll finish it. Soak into it and make it indestructible. So wet that with super glue. The super glue dries. Put on a coat or two of clear varnish. So rather than wait for that to happen, I have one wait as I did earlier. So this portion here is what's going to accept the junction tube and silicone tube and PVC tube and something like that. So, a wax thread. Here I'm using 140 denier uh, UTC. It's the third attempt at making this film. I tried using the 70, but uh, that just resulted in a lot of swearing. So for the body, I'm going to use a uh, silver holographic flat braid. So put that on on my side, wrap back to the butt, and then go forward to the head. Now, you can wrap that straight, or you can just put on a little bit of super glue. It's really easy for making bodies out of. Wrap that forward to the point where we want to have our head. A little bit of a pull there. Wrap over. I like to pull it back on itself for a little bit of security. So, trim that. For the wing of this, I'm going to use a chartreuse bucktail. I'm going to cut off a bunch of that. And I'm going to have that one and a half to two times the length of the body, so roughly there. Set that up onto my fly. So to roll it around itself, even that out around, and tighten it up a couple of wraps. Now the bases of this. scissors you can use a scalpel blade if you feel like it. Now just to secure that I'm going to soak my hang thread into the boot. Wrap forward onto those tag ends and then back on itself. So now I want to put a bit of flash in, so I'm going to take a couple of strands here of uh, wrinkle mirror flash. Tie that on. Fold it back on itself. And cut that up. Now for the wing as such, I'm going to use a bit of black goat.
strength of our wing plus a little bit more. So we'll measure that up. Is one that doesn't compress very easily. You can use bucktail for this if you feel like it. Now, what I'm going to do is again to soak the tie on thread in some super glue, put on a couple of wraps, and I want to get some super glue to soak into. That's essentially the fly. Now, Posh Tosh usually has a red or orange jungle cut, so here I'm going to do that. Position those up on the side. back if you want. Wrap over the bases. A small head on this one because it's there as an attractor. It's bright red. Finish that off. Tush style bucktail fly. <laughs>